One second. I might have to sneeze. We're good. I think it's gone. Um, what's up, everyone? Oh, I was about to sneeze. It was coming. And then it didn't. Um, hello, everyone. How's working on the rookie? It's great. I'm excited for season six. It's going to be really fun. But, yeah. Okay, since there's like a good amount of people on here. <sighs> I wanted to talk. I wanted to talk about this specific thing. Because I don't really know how I'm supposed to make a video about this. And I really don't want to make a video about it. But um, I need to voice my opinion on a specific thing. Oh yeah, also I've had like a cold for the past like maybe week now. So it sounds like I've been bawling my eyes out. I also just had like a really um, tough day today. And so that's also some of it. But back to my opinion. My opinion, okay. My opinion doesn't matter, but um, I just like, I feel like if I explain this to like any of my friends, like, they won't quite understand where I'm coming from. I'm not sure. But have you guys seen those lives where these men are holding up a sign saying, basically, I will talk to you if you're my type? Because I have opinion. I have an opinion about this. So I want to know if you guys even know about these lives. Okay. These lives are so stupid. Maybe it's allergies. It probably is allergies. They're so annoying. Like, oh my gosh. This is how I feel about it, okay? It's, okay. Not, okay, everyone has a type. Let me start there. Everyone has a type. Great. That's great, right? And like, I guess, like, some people are using it to, like, find a girlfriend or something. I get it. It's, like, yeah, it's seeking for attention. And it's, like, these men have the audacity to go in live and then accept someone, seeing by their profile picture if they are other type or not. And, yes, they're, like, gaslighting. And they're, like, sometimes they won't even, like, when they don't talk... And the girl's, like, drop-dead gorgeous. I'm like, all right, you're just an idiot. And every girl that I've seen go on there is, like, perfect. And it doesn't even matter. It's like, if that's not your type, that's cool. Like, whatever. But from my standpoint, if I were to go on there and I would be like, oh, my God, like, I hope he's my type. Like, this is, this is my perspective on it. And then he doesn't talk. Do you know how much that will fuck with my head? Like, it's literally seeking, they're seeking for attention. And I see girls do it too. I haven't seen girls do it. Only guys, but the same thing. The same thing goes for, you know, girls too. I mean, that's just like my opinion on it. Like, I literally get so frustrated when I see stuff like that because, oh. What are you talking about? Okay, for the people that just joined, I'm talking about those lives where people hold up signs. Because I guess girls are doing it too. But um, people are holding up signs saying like, um, I will talk to you if you're my type or whatever like that. So I'm just voicing my opinion how stupid this trend is and why it needs to stop. Um, I... It's legit my biggest pet peeve. No, it is. Like, I hate, especially, like, especially that, like, it's becoming a trend. It's so annoying. And it's all over my For You page. Like, I hate that it's on my For You page. Um, people who don't understand what I'm saying, I'm talking about when those people hold up signs on live streams on TikTok and will be like, I will talk to you if I, um, if you're my type. Which is, like, 
okay, you can click not interested on live streams. Because, guys, that stuff floods my For You page, and it's so annoying. I know, and it's confusing because I feel like there's so many other people live all the time, and they're not doing trends, and they're just, like, chilling, and, like, I'd rather see their lives than other people just, like, dogging on other people. Just, like, completely being rude and disrespectful. Like, I am very... I don't know why it just pisses me off. Like, I don't know. I better wash my mouth. <sighs> also, guys, it looks like I've been crying, but my allergies have been bad. I had pretty, I had a pretty shitty day today. Um, Dylan, he left me on open. What do I do? <sighs> Literally ignore him. Like, just let him. Let him do his thing. Don't answer. Don't, like, be like, hey, you left me on red. Um, I've been there. Um, just literally just ignore him. Just ignore him. Act like you don't care. Nah, it would piss off anyone. Imagine how much backlash people would get if they did that in person. Okay, that's another thing. Okay. <gasps> no one, anyone who's doing this kind of shit on live where they're holding up the signs and they're saying like, I'll talk to you if you are my type. No one has the, you know what, um, to say something, to do that to someone in person. So it's like, if you can't do that in person, don't do it on a live stream. <laughs> That's my, that's honestly, I saw someone say that. Oh my God, I told my crush a joke about this story and he left me on red. Why do our crushes think that they have the audacity? <laughs> um... Just honestly, if you if this any if happens to any of you guys, literally just ignore them. Do you like country music? I love country music. Country music's my favorite genre of music. It's always been. <sighs> Flex your biceps. I got none. Ooh. Oh my god! Like anytime I go live, anytime the camera's on, I just start yawning. This is bad. You should make a country song. I feel like no one would listen to it. So I feel like not everyone loves country music, so. Can we say hi to Skylar? He's at work right now, but he'll be back later. Um. What if your ex tries to come back? Well, you have to think about it. Was he good? Or was this ex a good person? Or a shitty person because they're a shitty person and they say they've changed over like two weeks i wouldn't even give them time of day did you get your tattoos yet i did guys i'm gonna post them soon i just like i like told my mom but i didn't tell my mom and so like i'm surprising her when i see her on wednesday so um and she has like social media so i don't want her seeing that The day or night there. It's a night. It's 9.23 p.m. Oh, my God. Okay. I'm back. Sorry. That's a big yawn. How many did you get? I got two. But I'm going to get more. Like, I don't know why, but I think it's just, like, I actually really enjoyed it. And I like the way they look. Do you and Caden still live together? No, Caden lives with his friend Kevin, and I live with my boyfriend and... Um, my roommate Austin. Tattoos are addictive. Kind of, yeah. I mean, my back, I have one on my back and it hurt. It hurt a lot, so. For the people that I see who are, like, fully tatted with, like, thick ink, like, props to you. Like, I actually don't think I could go through that pain. I mean, I'd probably end up doing it anyway, but, um, like, respect. Because I was crying over my little back tattoo. Can 
you flip your eyelids inside out i actually i have never tried no i feel like i'm gonna rip my lashes out have you watched scream i haven't mainly because i'm terrified of watching scary movies i like watching scary movies but i'll go home and i'd be like the whole time so sometimes it's best i don't watch it but i also love watching it too Ooh. oh my gosh i keep yawning i tried taking a nap earlier today and i couldn't literally couldn't fall asleep so hold your boyfriend he is 20. Is it bad that I'm at work and watching your life? No, I mean, is your boss there? If not, you're just chilling with me. Just like act like I'm a customer, like I'm asking you like, you know, questions. <laughs> hmm. My ex was guilt tripping me and manipulating me. <sighs> you just gotta. You gotta block them on everything. <laughs> That's like my mentality. Of like, if I like, I think how I've reacted before, like I know like the best way to react now. <laughs> Who are you closest with on the rookie? Probably Melissa. I mean, just, like, we don't really, like, we don't talk, like, outside the rookie, but, um, actually, no, we have before. But anytime I go there, she's just really cool, and I just like hanging out with her. Oh, my gosh. What's a life lesson you learned recently? I'm getting too old for drama. <laughs> That's something I just learned. Like. I don't know. I just. I just want to be happy. And. Yeah. That's all really it. Guys. I'm going to go tan tomorrow. And I probably should put some sunscreen on. Because my chest is burnt. So. Burnt from yesterday. What got you into acting? I sucked at every sport. Except, I can throw a football pretty far. Like, I can do the spiral thing. Like, I'm actually... Uh, I don't know. Maybe in my past life, I was like a football player or something. I don't know why. But I can throw a football. Like a champ. Um, girl, fix those lashes. I get this comment every time... And I know it's just a joke, but genuinely, guys, I actually fucked up my lashes a lot. I mean, just this one. It's just from the perm stuff that gets put on your lashes when you get lash lifts. I did not deal with it the best. Ooh. Oh my god. I saw this funny trend where people would go on people's lives and they would like screenshot them and then they would like make them their profile picture and it would like trip people out like i would freak out i if i was live and i started seeing like my face on people's profiles i'd be like what the you made me yawn isn't that crazy i made you yawn and we could be thousands of miles away i would say we are connected so yeah What happened to snow? Snow. And I'm three hours away. Me and you right now. Okay. 928. Oh my gosh. How long do your lash lips last? Probably like two weeks, I would say pillow look hella comfy i got it from urban outfitters i've had it for like two years it's it's my favorite 
Um. Oh, this too. Sometimes. Love, are you sad? No, I'm not sad. I just have really bad allergies. I mean, I had kind of a weird day today, but it's just my allergies. I promise. Um, I go home Wednesday or Thursday. I'm not really sure, but I'm really excited because I get to see my puppy. I get to see my mom, my dad. My brother just landed there. Um, he, he went there earlier. Um... Who else do I get to see? I get to see my best friend, Kaylee. Um, I get to see my grandparents. I get to see my um, my uncle. And so, yeah, my parents just bought a house back home. And um, they are, like, loving their place. And their place is absolutely beautiful. So, me and Sky are driving down there Wednesday or Thursday to go see it. And we're going to be there for, like, a week. And, um... Yeah, so it's going to be fun because my grandparents are going to be there and I haven't seen them in like six months. So I wish I could see them more. And honestly, like on my behalf, I really do need to like step it up and go see them more for sure. How old are you? I'm 19. Ooh, that's weird. I was 18 like last week, so. I fell asleep listening to your music. You should get a dog or a cat. Guys, I am this close. Wait. I'm that close to getting a dog or getting a cat. That close. I'm like, my days are pretty, like, chill. Like, I don't have crazy days. Like, this past, like, week has been like nothing i had like one session like two meetings like i could get a dog and be chilling like i could get a dog and be chilling brie you cannot tell me that tomorrow let's go to the shelters (laughs) let's go to the dog shelters maybe i just go get a cat maybe that's what i need maybe a cat and then when i get like a backyard i can get a dog that makes that's a little bit more responsible because i also like when i leave for like sessions and stuff they're like six hours long and so i don't want to leave my dog here for six hours unless like the people are chill and like i could bring my dog with me but that's about it how long have you and kaylee known each other about 11 almost 12 years now she's like my full-on day one like I mean, like, we met in, like, second grade, but she was the only one from when I left home. She was, like, the only one that, like, stayed in contact with me and, like, would visit me and stay with me for, like, three weeks. So, yeah, she's for sure my day one. I'm supposed to be sleeping right now, but I don't want to get off this live. What do you have tomorrow? Do you have to be up early? Wipe your camera looks foggy. Okay. I think my camera is broken. Oh. Nice. It's just my screen being disgusting. Um... What's the outfit? Some sweatpants and um, a green tank I got from Amazon. I got both of them from Amazon, actually. Your eyebrows are perfect. Guys, they used to never look like this. I I saw my mom using this little shaver thing that she uses for eyebrows. And I was really young. And so I bought one. And so I was probably like 10 or 11. So I was like, okay, like, she goes over her eyebrows with it. Actually, no, she didn't. She just went over here, like, just outlined her eyebrows. And so I was like, okay, cool. So I, like, literally think I'm, like, layering my eyebrows, if that's even a fucking thing. And um, I layered them. Didn't really layer them. I had huge chunks just missing from my eyebrow. And so that's when I got into makeup and I started filling in my eyebrows, which 
I do not like that stage. That stage was terrible. That's probably one. That's probably my embarrassing stage, honestly. Like, when I used to fill my eyebrows in, God, if anyone showed me a picture from that time, I would die. I hated that era. That era was terrible. But, um, yeah, so then I stopped a long time ago. And um, I just, like, do them up anytime I need to. Like, right now, like, this needs to be cut because they wild up there. Um, but please post a picture. I will cry. I will cry. Bye, Dylan. Bye. I've been crying for hours. Your life is making me a bit happy, happier, though. Thank you. Oh, I'm glad. Stay on, please. Tattoo showing when? Tattoo showing... I'm gonna have to do it soon. I just, like, I haven't shown my mom yet. But, um... It's nothing, like, major. It's not, like, crazy. So the tattoo is... A tattoo for my parents. So my, my dad and my mom. So it's like, it's my dad and my mom. And it's like, kind of like what I grew up around. So. Yeah. Would she be mad you got one? No, she knows I got one. She just, I haven't showed her yet. <laughs> she keeps asking me. Hey, girly. Hey. How do you pronounce your last name? Conrique. I thought it was Conrique or Conrique, but it's Conrique. And I found that out when I was 15. Well, I don't even know what these gifts are. Wait, what was that? A dancing cactus. Thank you. Like Monique. Yeah, like Monique, Conrique. Which I don't even know why we didn't even think about that. Like my uncle's wife, literally her name is Monique. And we were calling ourselves Conrique. For some reason. I don't even know. Every time I tell people about your music, I'm scared to say it. <laughs> if you say it wrong, literally, my last name could be whatever you want it to be at this point. <laughs> like, I made it whatever I wanted to be for 15 years, so. You can do whatever you want. Whew. Wait, I just saw a comment that was like... Do you not like talking about the rookie? I love talking about the rookie. Um, people are just are usually just asking if I'm st still in contact with them. With the cast. Um, which I'm, I'm not really in contact with them. <laughs> What's your favorite ice cream flavor? Fla fla flavor? <laughs> flavor um mint chocolate chip yes for sure my favorite love this girl's nails thank you i get them done again because i always pick them off very fast so i'm getting getting them done on monday so hopefully i can keep them on Yeah. But I am going to get off. I'm gonna. Ooh. Wait, where are you Um. Anyways, I'm gonna get off. I gotta defrost the steak. Which means I literally just have to put steak in a warm temperature. Um, bowl of water so I have to do that and then I gotta take a shower so yes everyone on here thank you guys for coming my name is Dylan whatever you want my last name to be <laughs> but um I love talking with you guys you guys are amazing why every time when I get all like sentimental I start having this accent anyways um don't put it in a bowl of hot water so I can let it thaw. Oh. I just put it in, like, like, room temperature water. Is that bad? 
I've been doing that for so long. Even my mom's been doing that. Um, anyways, love you guys. You guys are amazing, and I will see you all very soon. See? There's the accent. Bye-bye.